Hello and welcome to the Swift tutorial. In this video, I am going to show you how to use the navigation controller. So that is one of the best ways to let the user navigate on and across your app. So if that is something you want to know, if you want to know how to use the navigation controller, then just keep on watching and I will show you how simple it is. So let's take a look at the navigation bar. And in order for us to be able to do that, we create a new Xcode project. It's going to be a single view application and I'm going to call it uh, navigation. Simple and easy. And I'm going to save it on my desktop. Now, all of the fun that we are going to get into in this tutorial right here is going to happen in the storyboard. So right now we have just a simple plain view controller, but we want the navigation controller. So let's delete all of that and drag in a navigation controller which should look like this. So here you have your navigation controller right here, which handles all of the navigation. And here you have an example view controller. I'm just going to delete that and drag in a normal view controller, just like that. And uh, I'm going to set this one to initial view controller because so that is the view controller that's going to appear when the app launches. So now we have our navigation controller and look at this as a separate entity. And this controls all of the navigation uh, with our navigation. So this is basically our navigation controller, which uh, is pretty evident from this name that is uh, central in the view controller. So let's zoom out here and here we have our basic normal view control. So if we want to use the navigation functions on this view controller, we will have to connect them up. And we do that by selecting the navigation controller and then control dragging over to our view controller and selecting relationship to be a root view controller. So if I now go ahead and launch the app, you will see that I already now have the basics of a navigation controller as it lets me jump over to the first uh, view controller. As you see, really not too much exciting here. It's just showing me the first view controller. But in order for us to get some action going here, I'm going to drag in a second view controller and I'm going to connect them both by clicking on my view controller, control dragging over, let's see, I'm going to select the yellow one, control dragging over to the second view controller and selecting show. So as you see, it now also adapted the functionality of being a navigation controller as it now has that nice bar up there. And now I'm also going to give it a name so I can click on my first view controller and give it a title. So I'm going to say this is my home view controller and this is my, let's say, uh, feed uh, navigation controller. So this one is going to, let's give it also a visible title, home. So this is my home view controller where the user is initially taken to and then he can click a button which we are going to drag in which is going to take him to the feed. So let's control drag over to the feed and click show. So let's launch the app and uh, you will see that this is the basics really of a navigation controller. And you will see that it's pretty simple and a very useful way of letting the user navigate in your and in and around your app. So here is my app. And as you can see, this is my first view controller with the button. And as we named it home, and then when I click on the button, I'm taken to the second view controller, which is my feed. And as you can see, this is the beauty of a navigation controller. I now have the home button. So the back button really that I can click in order to view the previous view controller. So this is how you set up a view controller. You can continue on as far as you want to, but the principles or the way to do it is the same. You have a navigation controller that handles all of the navigation and is responsible for this bar up here and taking care of, as I said, the navigation. And then you can extend it, extend it with multiple view controllers that are each connected 
to each other. So this is how you set up a navigation controller based app. Now, if you enjoyed this video, make sure that you click the subscribe button so that you stay tuned for future Swift tutorials. And uh, yeah, thank you for watching.